Hello, I'm Ashley Kenny, project permitting for First Solar on the Topaz Solar Farm project. The project would be located on the Carrizo Plain, which is a vast area. It stretches over 480,000 acres and is one of the sunniest areas in California. Here, on a site that avoids pristine native habitat, the Topaz Solar Farm will produce clean, renewable energy. First Solar has been working closely with the County of San Luis Obispo and the community to improve and enhance the Topaz Solar Farm design to address the needs and concerns that we have heard from the community. Using previously disturbed land avoids the more environmentally sensitive areas, including the National Monument, which is over six miles away from the site. First Solar is working to avoid or mitigate all impacts on endangered species. In addition, we studied possible visual, noise, traffic, and water issues and solutions. First Solar has designed many of these solutions into the project. First, the project's low profile with a five and a half foot typical solar PV array height. Probably the clearest way to demonstrate this is through this very accurate drive-by computer simulation, which models the view driving east and then south on Route 58 through the project site. And as you can see, the project recedes into the background from most of the observation points. To mitigate traffic impact, the Topaz project will prohibit truck traffic during commute hours, require the use of van shuttles for most construction workers, and create site access at least one mile away from the Carissa Plains Elementary School. First Solar has proposed several solutions to avoid noise impacts to the community. First, construction work hours will be limited to daytime hours. In addition, construction noise impact to sensitive receptors, like residences, will be extremely limited, as each seven acre block of construction will typically take less than one week to complete. Once the project is fully completed and running, its operation is virtually silent. After the project's anticipated productive lifetime, the project can be decommissioned and the land will be able to return to agricultural use or to remain as natural grassland habitat. I'm Robert Jenkins, Director of Transmission and Interconnection at First Solar. I've been involved in the planning of electric transmission and the connection of new generation to the transmission grid in California for nearly 30 years. One of the reasons we chose this location for the Topaz Solar Farm is the presence of the existing transmission line running through the site, the 230KV Morro Bay Midway transmission line. The Topaz Solar Farm is co-located with this line to minimize the infrastructure necessary to connect the project to the transmission grid. And while improvements to the local transmission grid are needed to transmit the project's power to California consumers, the work is limited to upgrading existing transmission lines and will not require new lines or new rights of way. The California Independent System Operator, the planning and operating entity for the California Electric Transmission Grid, has identified seven transmission projects necessary for California to reach its renewable energy goals. The transmission upgrades to increase the capacity in the Carrizo Plain is one of these seven projects. And of the seven projects, it is the fastest to be implemented, the least impactful, requiring no new lines or new rights-of-way, and the least costly to California electric consumers. 